Today, boys, I think I found the best team of the year coin making method. This took me a long time to figure out, figure out the math for, and just all that in between. So if this video does help you at all, I really would appreciate if you could hit that subscribe and like button. I really would appreciate it. But anyways, let's get straight into this. Now, boys, this is kind of complicated, so it might take you a long time to get uh, understanding for. If you need to skip around at all in this video, go back, watch other parts back, go ahead and do that. But most importantly, make sure to watch through the entire video because there's a lot that goes into this. All right, so the first step in this method is we need to get 94 specifically playoff players 94 playoff players for around 100k depending on when you're sniping or what time of night it is or what like what time of day it is really you might need to filter down by all offense and all defense and currently i need to but basically we just need to get 394 playoff players for around 300k so like if i get a snipe for around 96k i might just buy the rest for like 102 but yeah like i said we're gonna be looking for these for about 100k a piece hopefully we can get this one right here here. Unfortunately, we do not. It is what it is. Ooh, come on, baby. Oh, no, I didn't. No way. We've got one for 99,100 coins. 97k right here. Can we get this one? Hey, we do head. We do go ahead and get that Debo Samuel for 97k. Let's go, boys. I'm gonna go ahead and scoop this one up for 103, 600 right here. Not that great of a deal, but I'm just gonna do it just to prove that this method you don't need to get that crazy of snipes for. All right, boys. So the next step in this method is we need to complete a 96 overall playoff set. Currently, the most expensive ones I think are the Evan McPherson and a couple others, but let's just go clarify which ones are the most expensive. You guys are obviously gonna have to check what is the most expensive at the time you're doing this because this is obviously going to fluctuate but right now it actually looks like evan mcpherson is kind of even up in value more than he was earlier when i was doing this and yeah currently evan mcpherson's over 270k so we're gonna go ahead and complete that set and i'll be right back with you guys all right and just like that when we complete the evan mcpherson set we do get his 96 overall as well as three 94 ncat cards and we're gonna come back to those in a little bit but just to show you guys evan mcpherson is selling for 273 right there which is actually a lot of coins i'm gonna go ahead and post them up for 270 hopefully he sells for that much and yeah i'll be back with you guys in one second to explain kind of what i'm gonna be doing here soon enough as well so to complete the evan mcpherson set right here we spent 300k total on this more exactly 300,300 coins but you know it doesn't really matter too much and right here our evan mcpherson did just sell for 243,000 coins so taking away how much we spent on the set for as much as that car just sold for we ended up losing 56,000 760 coins but boys don't worry this isn't going to actually make you lose 56,000 coins you like i said stay and watch the entire video because i'm gonna go ahead and redo the steps i just did and i'll be back with you guys once i do that and i'll break down all the numbers of why this works so see you guys once i do that all right boys i am back so basically what i have done now is you guys saw me complete the evan mcpherson set once live on video i just went off camera and completed it two more times as you guys can see you can add all nine of these cards up uh from the first five to these four other than the Corey Littleton basically everything on these two rows these all add up to a total of 905,000 coins all right now going over here these are the Evan McPherson's you guys can see on your screen right now this uh screen is a little adjusted obviously due to the fact that there's something in here that I sold which would spoil the rest of the video but as you guys can see here there's three Evan McPherson's that sold for around that 270 to 265k range taking all of those after tax and then also subtracting how much we spent on the sets leaves us 183,000 total coins that we are at a loss at. So right now we need to make 183,000 coins back. Now boys, this is where the method gets really crazy. Hopefully you guys are ready. So remember earlier when I was talking about the 94 end cats, we're actually going to be able to use tons of those right now. So as you guys can see right here, we have nine end cat 94s due to doing the sets and we get a 42,750 training. And I think you boys know now what we're going to be doing here so taking a trip over to the store as you guys are going to be able to see here we can go to the training section and as you guys can see 42,700 training is enough to do one of these team of the year packs you can kind of pick and choose what team of the year pack you want to do you could do specials and take the 2k extra training and then actually go over here and do some playbook and uniform packs just in case you kind of want to secure your coins that you made but for me i'm willing to take the risk and i'm going to go ahead and open this offensive player pack let's see if we can pull something good come on ea give me something good i i really don't know darren waller maybe ally marpet 
I'm not feeling that. Ali Marpet though is selling for around 240k. Now boys, before we get in the rest of the video here, keep in mind the worst team of the year player is 220k, I think. Somewhere around there. You can't really get worse than 220k, which means after tax, you're guaranteed to get 200k from this team of the year pack. All right, boys, so our Ali Marpet did just sell. Going back over to my auctions, you can see the Ali Marpet sold for 238,100. So if you take away that whatever 183,000 coins from earlier, after tax, we profited 31,000 coins on this Ali Marpet set. But if you guys can scroll over just a little bit, pan your eyes over to the Justin Jefferson. I did this earlier, got Justin Jefferson. Also got more snipes to complete the Evan McPherson sets, as well as we sold Evan McPherson for a little bit more on those sets. I actually profited 100k when I pulled the Jeff Justin Jefferson, getting more snipes as well as selling the Evan McPhersons for more. So yeah, as you guys can see, this video took a long time to make as well as figure out all the coins and how all the math added up. So make sure the math still adds up for when you guys do this. I don't want you to lose a lot of coins. That's why I told you to stick around at the end. And yeah, if you made it this far, you might as well hit that like and subscribe button for all my hard work. And hopefully you guys are able to make as many coins as I did on this method. Peace out, boys. Love you.